Good morning. Today is Monday. It's December 25th. It's Christmas morning, the year is 2023. And I'm sitting on this floor next to the Christmas tree. I don't, know if y'all, I don't even know if I even showed you all a picture of this Christmas tree. There ain't nothing on top of it. It barely got decorated this year. Um, this year was a, this last Christmas, you know, it was my first Christmas in this house. And I did a bunch of stuff here last year. This Christmas, I was doing some um, more renovations. I just completed three bathrooms and just a bunch of work here in the house. And so I was exhausted. I literally just finished the bathroom up yesterday, the day before yesterday. And uh, I was supposed to pictures of that. So this is a quiet Christmas here. I decided I'm going to have a whole bunch of people over today because I just I did Thanksgiving here and I was exhausted and then you know at the, at the end of the Thanksgiving feast I had to clean up this massive mess and I said you know what I'm not doing it after Christmas so it is a quiet day it's gonna be a small dinner here at the house um I'm gonna think my mother's coming over I need to call her make sure she knows to come over that's basically it <laughs> mama me two dogs um anyway not a lot of folks over. Quiet day, peaceful rest, sleep, eat. That's a holiday should be. Oh, it would have been nice to have a whole bunch of people running around the house, but to be honest with you, I'm kind of tired. And the older you get, you know, these types of holidays leading up to them can be exhausting. The cooking, the food, the prepping, the cleaning, the preparing, the cleanup afterwards is like, okay, I'd rather really be in the mom's. I could, like I said, I could have had a V8. So next year I will make sure I am in the Bahamas somewhere on some cruise ship someplace to hell fuck this shit. I decorate a tree and run my ass about here. But I wanted to take this time to thank you all for you know riding with me these this past few twelve months. These years fly by so quickly. I started doing this YouTube channel in two thousand twelve after so many people um, kept telling me to do this. And I need to be on YouTube, and I was like kind of reluctant at first, but then I, I did it, and it kind of exploded. And um, I've had a lot of financial success with my YouTube channel. I could have had more if I posted more videos, but you know, I'm happy with what I'm doing here. It's not, you know, I'm not. I don't have a million followers. I uh, barely have a hundred thousand. I'm fine. I like the videos that I do. Uh, I stand by the stuff that I do. I believe in what I post on my channel. You know, I'm not an a entertainment guru, so I'm not really going after all the entertainers and the entertainment world and all that stuff. I do post about stuff. I try to post about everything. But my, ultimately, I am extremely grateful for those of you who decided to hang out here with me on my YouTube channel. To spend your days with me laughing with me, having fun with my crazy ass. Um, it is a, um, it's a joy to be able to wake up and do something that you love to do. Um, I, I'm not gonna sit here and lie, so I'm gonna put out more videos. Uh, yeah, all right, I wish I could put out more content. It's a little bit more complicated than that. Um, I guess maybe if I had a dedicated space here in the house where I could just get up and launch into a video shoot. But sometimes I like to do videos where I think things through about what I wanna say, research, you know, get to know you know I just don't like posting videos just be posting videos and then the content don't make sense or it's not something I believe in I like to do my research there were a couple of stories I was going to report on today and I decided it's Christmas day I'm not going to bog you all down with that Uh, some people are not having the best Christmas right now there was a particular story of a young woman a um, an Instagram um, influencer who just moved here to Georgia and she met some guy. I'm not sure how she met and they were dating or something. Well, he tried to kill her um, and he ended up killing himself. They didn't even know each other uh, a long period of time. On top of the fact, this was a black woman and he was a black guy. And they didn't know each other a long period of time. Um, she just moved here. Uh, she met him. You got to be very careful who you bring into your inner circle. I don't think she knew that man was crazy as hell like that. But he tried to kill her, and, and, and she's in a critical condition in the hospital. And he did kill himself in the process of doing all this. 
you just have to wonder what's going on in people's minds that, you know, <laughs> really, I mean, this the days before Christmas, this mother had to fly down here from, you know, she had to fly down from um, Texas to sit here in, in Atlanta in the hospital with her daughter who just moved here. And there's something in the water here that ain't right here in Atlanta with these men here in the city and how they will harm women so quickly in the past. And I didn't really go into details of this because, you know, this Christmas Day, but let's just say that in the past year, there have been so many African-American black women killed here in Atlanta by boyfriends and husbands, not just here, but, you know, this is a problem that, that's um, pretty much nationwide. I'm not exactly sure what enters into these men, what goes on in their mind that someone you just met, you know, you don't even know, you've only known just a few months and their relationship begins to go south, that your solution is to kill that person and kill yourself. It's kind of like, okay, obviously there were some mental health issues going on with this individual long before she met this crazy man. Be careful who y'all meet y'all. You gotta learn to be careful. I don't know what's going on with this damn song. Everybody listening to Christmas. Uh, you gotta be careful who you meet these days. I'm telling you, everybody's some crazy people out here. You know, and I was, there was a couple of stories I was gonna do, and I had saved the news articles, and I said, yeah, I'm, I'll do it later, maybe next year or something. I don't know. But this you know, next year is just in a few days. But you know, this is a. A, a quiet Christmas here, and I'm gonna have a quiet Christmas. You know, it's not a house full of people running around here. You know, there was no whole bunch of gifts under Christmas tree in back then. <laughs> there, there were none under this Christmas tree, not a one. <laughs> no, no, just a decorated tree up here. I will show you all some videos of the completed bathroom and the process that we went through. It's about 90% complete. I'm waiting for the light fixtures to arrive. And, you know, it came out pretty nice. So, you can't complain. I did some accent walls here in the house. I did, yeah, I did some stuff here, but um, that was my Christmas gift, I guess. We never went to the damn house. Yeah, I never buy. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, the house is a beautiful home. Like the next owner will love every bit of it. I thought I went through hell renovating because I'm sure I'll get my ass up out of here as soon as I can. I wish the next owner good luck. Yeah, he is done. He's yours, honey. He's the key. You yeah, know, but. I hope that you all are having a safe holiday. Um, as you get older, you see the world differently. I've learned to laugh and enjoy life because you know what happens from day to day. So you have to take it 24 hours at a time and enjoy life. I try not to stress myself out of this stuff. You can't stress yourself. Some, some things you don't have any control over. And it's just best just to enjoy the ride you know take it one day at a time that's all I can tell you you know life can be wonderful but you got to surround yourself with wonderful people and sometimes you don't even have to surround yourself with nobody to have a wonderful time by yourself be careful this holiday season drinking no drinking and driving go out there have fun enjoy yourselves have fun enjoy this beautiful Christmas day like I said, this is going to be a short little video. I'm about to, I got it. It's almost 11 o'clock. I need to start finish. I'm doing a little prime rib. I don't take long to cook that prime rib, though. And I'm making some sweet potato when we cut those up. I started cutting them up. Um, I was going to do some macaroni and cheese. I'm not doing that macaroni and cheese. But, uh, yeah, I'm just going to do the sweet potatoes. And, yeah, this is a small little dinner. Not major. But like I said, thank you all for riding with me for the past 12 months. Hopefully I will do some more videos before the end of this year, maybe later today, depending on how I feel. I think we've been in fellow sleeping guys and stuff. It's not going on my ears. Enjoy your family members or, or friends or whatever you like to do on today's day. You know, it's Christmas Day. Some people don't even celebrate Christmas, so they probably just, for some of us, just a regular Monday. But for me, it's the day to relax, chill, and great memories of past Christmases with family members and friends and hopefully I'll be able to make uh, more memories with family members and friends on a cruise ship in the Bahamas <laughs> you better get your tickets now I will not be I should have I like when, for some reason I love 
getting out of the country during the holidays, Thanksgiving, Christmas, going places and doing nice stuff, having fun. Those memories are really wonderful. You're in Aruba, I was in Aruba for Thanksgiving. I'm trying to remember, where have I been for Christmas? I can't remember. Hmm. I don't remember. But anyway, today it is Monday. It's December 25th. The year is 2023. Um, thank you all, like I said, for riding along with me, watching my videos, sharing my videos, commenting in the videos. I'm very grateful to have an audience who enjoys what I do. Um, I enjoy what I do. Thank you for being with me, riding along with me, commenting, um, agreeing with me or disagreeing with me or whatever. Um, I'm grateful to have you all. And have a great Christmas, a uh, regular Monday. And don't eat too much. Don't drink too much. Enjoy your day. Laugh. Have fun. It's just a day. And it's just one day. It'll be over in a few hours. In fact, we're about 11 hours into it. So enjoy this beautiful day. And uh, I'll look forward to you all in the next video. I'm out of here. I'm out. Merry Christmas. And have a wonderful holiday with your family and friends or just if it's just you enjoy your day i'm out bye